hey, I'm back, and I do understand that uh, the lighting is not that great because I have a backup camera, but let's just go with it. Today's topic is on diabetes. I had a question from someone that wanted to know, how am I going to address the medications that I'm on? I want to start keto, but what's going to happen when I start keto, and am I going to need more medication or less medication? All right. First thing is my disclaimer, always check with your doctor when you're adjusting your medications or trying to get off medications. Uh, doctors are trained in medication, so I'm sure that they will be able to adjust your medication based on your blood sugars. Diabetes is a disease of high sugar. The medications that you're on are designed to lower the blood sugar. Even metformin, which targets the receptors for insulin, help the receptors become more receptive to insulin, allowing insulin to work better to lower your blood sugars. Now, here's the problem. When you lower your carbs, the need for that medication goes way down. And so if you're on keto and you're still taking the medication, you're going to end up with low blood sugars, hypoglycemia. So you might experience those symptoms. So it is important to work with a doctor to do this as well as having your own testing device to measure your blood sugars frequently. Now, for some people, the blood sugars come down pretty quick. Others, it takes time. So it's really an individual situation depending on how bad your diabetes is. But the good news is your blood sugars will come down and the need for medication will be a lot less. The key question is this, and you should check with your doctor on this. Should you ever take diabetic medication? if your blood sugars are normal or low? But the right answer is no, because why the heck would you ever in a million years wanna take blood sugar lowering medication when you already have low blood sugar? It's just gonna push it lower and lower and lower. It could be dangerous. So you need to make adjustments and each person is different and I'm sure your doctor will be able to help you out with that. But the other point I wanna make, which is so wild to me is that Sometimes dietitians, sometimes doctors will recommend consuming carbohydrates when you're a diabetic. It does not make sense. Why would you ever want to eat a high carbohydrate diet if you have high sugars in your blood? It does not make any sense. The high sugars are coming from the dietary sugars and carbs, and the need for medication is going to be greater and greater the more you do that. And the problem is the more medication you take, the more side effects you're going to have and the other thing is, where do you think that blood glucose is going when you take that medication? It's being converted into fat. It's being shoved into the organs as fat, as visceral fat. It's basically shifting this problem, high blood glucose, to another problem over here. It's not actually correcting anything. But if you're new to keto, what you need to do is learn how to do it correctly, work with your doctor on adjusting the medications, and do it to the point where your need for medication is much, much less if you need any medication at all. If you're new to keto, I put a link down below of exactly how to do it. Thanks for watching. Hey, before you go, if you're benefiting from any of my content, I would love to hear about your success story. Please share it in the link down below.